Okay guys, so today I have got a package in the mail from a FedEx delivery guy. Uh, it's a pretty big package as you can see. Um, I ordered something off of Snickers out. I usually don't do reviews and things of that nature on YouTube, but uh, I did it once before, so I figured why not do it on this. A lot of people like that previous one. It was another video. I'll leave the link down in the description. But let's go ahead and open it. Let's see what we got today. Okay. All right. On the front here it says air. I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. But it says max on the front. I guess this is their little mascot right here in the front big nike box it's a huge box today we got the nike adapt air max size 12 okay these came out maybe like a week a week ago maybe a week and a half ago so we're gonna go ahead and open this box let y'all see exactly what we got going First thing, we got that nice embroidery for the Nike symbol on the lid covering. Okay, it says Max. I still auto. Okay, that's what this is. It says auto. A U T O. I don't know if y'all could tell that says auto, but that's what it means. All right. Okay. Got a little card with a little mascot on there. And on the back it says Auto My Auto Max NSW Auto Mascot. Okay, so that's his name is Auto Max. That's the mascot's name. So let's get into the shoe. All right, so let's get a close-up view. Exactly what we're looking at: the Auto Max Nike Air Maxes, uh, size 12. First time actually seeing them um, in person. Never seen. They had multiple different colorways on these shoes. So, this, the all black, I just thought, you know, just buy it just because you got know, a futuristic, um, if you can hear it. As you see on the front, it loosens it. And then it tightens it down also sort of reminds me of the um air mags looks identical with the mesh whatever fabric this is right here on the front is very breathable um nice nike emblem right here on the side both sides with a nike nike check on the bottom end got a nice fat air bubble in person these shoes are humongous it's a size 12 i know that's a a pretty decent size shoe, um, a, de a pretty decent shoe size, but these shoes look like they're at least 14, maybe 15 inches long. These shoes are ridiculously huge. Um, yeah, so I don't want to really wear them or nothing like that. Just purchasing just to do a little review and also, you know, just get some future tech from Nike. I mean, I highly doubt I'll be able, capable enough to even afford a pair of some Nike Air Mags. Um, those are replicas from the Back to the Future movie shoes. But yeah, as you can tell, the plus and the subtract symbol actually lights up. And you can connect these to Bluetooth also. Let's see what else we got inside of the shoe box. And then we'll come right back to these shoes. Alrighty. Got the Adapt Nike manual. I guess this is a manual. Big safety manual. Won't need that. Okay. Whoa. That's pretty cool. The thing to be in to separate the shoes is actually a package itself. So you pull it out. Got the little guy on the back, Nike on the front. Let's 
see what's in here. Oh, that's fairly nice, guys. You see the little Auto Max guy right here, all gold. And then you got a little, another little Nike box. Package, really nice foam material, you know, just, just because I don't know. I guess it's a big deal with these new tech shoes. Okay, so we got a USB charger cable and the outlet plug. So that's for that. I guess, I don't know exactly if you plug these shoes directly into this adapter, but I'm just gonna keep looking. Um, let's actually show y'all this little guy. He looks pretty weird, but it's a little gold guy. It's not, it's plastic. There's nothing ridiculous about it. On the bottom end, it says, Medicom toy. It's an auto with a Nike check. So yeah, it's just something, you know, to put on your own desk or whatever in your little shoe collection or whatnot. Pretty nice. Go old little toy. You know, give it to your kids or whatever. Alright, on to the next thing that comes in this box. This box actually has a lot of accessories that come with it. I did not expect that. Okay, so it got a little secret compartment down here on the bottom. Nike Adapt Charger 1.0. So, from the look of it, it has a little uh, port for the USB port, the plug-in right here on the side. So I'm assuming USB charger and the uh, outlet plug connects to this. Stick with me. And you set it on top of your shoes like that. You sit the shoes on top of it and it charges it. Um, these shoes are actually Bluetooth connect. I'm not gonna try to pull out my phone and connect it all like that. It's it's only um I, I read it actually, it's only um connecting the increase the tightness of the shoe and decrease the tightness of the shoe. It doesn't do anything like Bluetooth playing music or nothing like that. Uh I think you can also change the lights on the buttons but otherwise than that size 12 i never seen a shoe like this it looks like a a good nike shoe like you know it's nike with all the different nike emblems that they have on it you know nike air on the back and of course that one on above yeah otherwise than that this is a pretty thick shoe you know, they got the auto max on the inside of the shoe. I don't know if y'all can see that, but yeah. Other than that, I give these shoes for the price it was going for, which was $400 for these shoes. I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend buying these, but I like it that it's all black. They had multiple different colorways, you know, orange, black, whatever. It's different. The all black stands out to me and mostly all black and all white shoes. You know, it's just a, a, a sight grabber. So, yeah, out of, out of 10, I give these shoes roughly, I give them a 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10 just for the style, but it's just ridiculously long. It literally, the shoe part where your foot fits in starts along here. It ends right here in this little, you got a little gap. A little gap sitting right here behind. I guess that's for multiple support systems that they got. Because they got an actual, they got an air bubble. And then there's an indention on the sole of the shoe. So it's a lot of support. Um, the shoes look and feel really good. But it's just a big shoe, man. And I really can't see nobody wearing this. Um you know, to run track in or play basketball in. These are more just to step out and one of those type of shoes, you know, something you don't really wear on a daily basis. So, I mean, they got a little plastic toe box protector right there for your toes, I guess, when you knock it or whatever. But yeah, otherwise than that, these shoes, they're okay. 
All right, for 400 bucks, I don't know about that much. Maybe three, maybe 250. I'd be way better with that price range, but the all blacks, they're really nice. They got a little, little paint splatter. I don't know if y'all can tell along the foam end part of the shoe. Yeah, and it also has the 3M tag on the back end that you can pull, you know, to put your foot in and whatnot. And so, nothing special about that. Um, so, yeah. So, these are the Nike Adapt Auto Max. Yeah, size 12, guys. Um, they recently just came out. So, retail 400. I can see these possibly going maybe mm, 400 to. 600 it's nothing really dramatic about it i think they also have these still in stock on sneakers app that's why i purchased these on on the day of the release so yeah otherwise than that guys y'all should just go ahead and check them out see if y'all like them i would highly recommend in taking a look at this shoe before you purchase it it's a very um it's not a very cheap shoe at all so yeah guys so Thank y'all for viewing, man, and get y'all some close-up images of the shoe. And uh, if y'all like this review of this sneaker, I have a pretty uh, decent amount of shoes in my collection. In my collection, but I feel like, I don't know if y'all want me to review the shoes I have or review shoes I've purchased or shoes that's coming out recently. So just drop, you know, um, any questions or knowledge that you have about shoes. And I will try to get back in touch with you as soon as possible. So thank y'all for watching. Leave a like, subscribe to this channel for more. If this video gets, <laughs> let's say a thousand views, this video get a thousand views in the next week. Within a week, I would do another review on a different set of pair of shoes, or I might even review how these fit on feet. I do not want to try them on. These are brand new, so I think y'all understand. Um, and the presentation of these shoes are actually pretty decent, but really bulky, really expensive. Eight out of ten. So see y'all guys on the next one. Thank y'all for viewing, and y'all have a wonderful day. Happy early Christmas. Happy early New Year's. Y'all be safe.